Ferno provides a number of patient handling and splinting alternatives when the patient's condition does not include a suspected spinal injury or require immobilization. When using each Ferno product, follow these general guidelines. Ferno products are designed for professional use only by two trained operators. Be sure all operators read the manual. Use each product only when it is in good condition. Practice using each product before placing them in service. Follow approved emergency patient handling procedures to properly apply to the patient. The Ferno Model 108 Pole Stretcher is designed to transport a patient from the rescue site to an emergency vehicle. It features heavy-duty aluminum poles with hand grips and a vinyl-coated nylon cover. To use the stretcher with a patient, unroll the stretcher next to the patient and transfer the patient onto the bed of the stretcher using EMS-approved procedures. When carrying the stretcher, both operators should face forward in the direction of travel. Use additional help when needed to safely lift the patient onto the stretcher. After use, be sure to clean and disinfect the stretcher. Clean all surfaces with warm water and a mild detergent. Use a stiff bristled brush if necessary. Rinse with warm water and towel or air dry. Disinfect all surfaces following the disinfectant manufacturer's directions for use. The Ferno vacuum mattress is a vacuum activated full body splint device designed to immobilize all or part of a patient's body. It features six carrying handles, three patient restraints, and a pillow with adjustable positioning. Sharp objects can damage the mattress. Clear sharp objects away or cover them with a thick blanket before laying the mattress down. To apply the mattress, unfold the mattress and lay it next to the patient with the air valve, pillow, and restraints facing up. Open the restraints and lay them to the sides of the mattress. Adjust or remove the pillow as needed. Smooth the mattress to a uniform thickness. Transfer the patient onto the mattress using local protocols. Center the patient on the mattress as much as possible and fasten the restraints. Connect the vacuum pump to the valve stem and begin removing air from the mattress by operating the pump handle. As the air is drawn out of the mattress, mold the mattress around the patient. Continue until the mattress is as rigid as desired. Disconnect the pump and tighten the valve as needed. Use the carrying handles to lift and transport the patient on the mattress. To remove a patient from the mattress, manually stabilize the patient throughout the procedure. Unfasten the restraints. Open the valve to allow air into the mattress so the mattress will become pliable and no longer hug the patient's body. When the mattress is as pliable as desired, transfer the patient from the mattress using local protocols. Ferno vacuum splints are vacuum activated and designed to immobilize and support an injured part of the body. They are made of durable, vinyl coated polyester and filled with polystyrene beads. Choose the splint size that best suits the injury. The splint should be large enough to extend beyond the joints on both sides of the injury. To apply a splint, one operator manually stabilizes the injured part of the body throughout the splinting procedure while the other operator applies the splint. Lay the splint flat with the valve upward and smooth the splint to a uniform thickness. Using EMS approved techniques, place the splint around the injury with the valve on the outside. Make sure you have access to the valve. Secure the splint in place with the hook and loop adjustment straps. Connect the vacuum pump to the valve stem. The pump operator begins removing air from the splint by pulling and pushing the pump handle. As air is drawn out of the splint, the second operator continues to manually stabilize the splinted area of the body and, if necessary, gently molds the splint to the body. Continue until the splint is as rigid as desired. Disconnect the vacuum pump from the air valve and tighten the adjustment straps if necessary. Ferno air splints are inflatable splints designed to immobilize and support a patient's extremity when a fracture is suspected. Air splints are inflated using lung pressure and require the physical effort of one of the operators. Choose the splint size that best suits the injury. 
the splint should be large enough to extend beyond the joints on both sides of the injury. To apply a splint, one operator manually stabilizes the injured part of the body throughout the splinting procedure while the other operator applies the splint. Open the splint zipper and gently slide the splint onto the injured extremity using care to minimize movement. Close the zipper smoothly and carefully, avoiding snags or sudden movement. Pull outward on the valve stem to open, then inflate with lung pressure only. Do not use mechanical or compressed air to inflate. Push the valve stem in to close. Monitor the patient's condition before, during, and after application for changes to the injured area.